Welcome, Travelers Champions, Heroes and Villains, to the adventure. Last we left off, we started up the Blood Mage, the little summoner that uses their health, as you can tell, because we are at 36 health. Uh, hopefully. I mean, we do have a couple healing potions, so we're not terribly low on health overall, as need be. We got the worm. Activate the worm. Barrier down on is it a little barrier down on us. And call that around. But we would like to find ways of consistent healing. As it would be very, very useful. That used up three? Interesting. Let's do it. Uh, Golems uh, had a better day here and there, but do a Grim Golem. We will bump up his existence. We will activate our big worm. We'll just get rid of the disturbance from our deck so we don't grow out again a little later. Pretty solid. That ought to be just fine. So let's just barrier for protection. End it so that the worm can destroy you without us offering up any more health. And there we go. Let's see what we got at the fortune cellar. Day, stranger. I'm in need of probably some healing if you got some, but you don't. So bye. Uh, training grounds. That's a candle. I have no idea what that is. We have an altar, which has to be good. A fountain of health. <laughs> Love the sounds of that. Let's give him some protection. Stun all enemies for two turns, but they are immune to stun, correct? Not played, gain 40 barrier. Love it. Itself, man, you know, if it could heal everyone, it'd be quite fantastic. Let's draw somebody and cast a ritual from him. Looking good. Let's increase his existence and let's offer less of our health for a golem. Just to make sure that we're fantastic and home heals everyone, right? When they yeah, heals all allies when they die. So let's ritual up our said ritual up our worm. Ritual our worm. Not asking for too much there. And there we go. Should still be good. Just need to be careful about our ritual and health. And we're good. That's some more blood. Ah, so close to that level. Tome of Knowledge. Draw some cards. And let's go to that fountain of hell. Hopefully it gives us like a full heal or something. Early explorers of Avalon found many springs with supernatural properties. Including ones that could heal. Uh, oh, I get a whopping 15. Feel refreshed. It might not be safe to stay here much longer. Uh, take the risk. Like, I need drinks. Uh, existence. Grimoire. A ritual. Barrier on herself. I said, barrier on herself. Deal a big hit. Oop, that is not what I wanted to do, even remotely. So. Let's see what we're. Rotate. There we go. Uh, protection. Control development. It's not really what I wanted. Let's get 
that ritual going. See if we can just keep drinking and fighting enemies, I guess. Uh, yeah, let's get a blood abomination and a little more barrier on ourselves. It's beautiful. Big ol' healer. Alright. What? Uh. Crap. <laughs> Virtual? Virtual? Uh. Barrier? Barrier? <laughs> Ugh. Five. Virtual? Golem. Call that a day on that turn. Okay. And. Let's. 16. Nope. Let's have you do that, which will heal us, because then. Ah, there we go. Aha! That's why you want to overcharge out your golems. Didn't even think it through. Again, it's always extra thoughts. Create zero barrier, one or ten for each minion. Activate two random minions. Activate a minion and draw a card. You know, I would like to activate two minions. When your HP is below 25%, all offerings restore HP instead of hurting you. That's kind of what we're talking about. Uh, yeah. So, I'm not going to kill myself. Oh, I mean, I got full health, though. I'm not going to say no to that. Go take out these hunting grounds. Let's get Blood Abomination. Let's get a ritual going. Yeah, we're looking pretty good. Was that the attack one? The one that I let, the totem of the wolf that I let kill us the last time? <laughs> uh, volatile magic? Stun an enemy. Okay. Ritual. And yes, I would like to stun that enemy. Actually, I probably should have stunned you, but... I'm apparently very terrified of the wolf now. <laughs> Damage everywhere. See? Producing damage back. Existence? Yes. Um, let us increase his armor. Let's get ourselves a Grim Worm. And let's do some crazy uh, buffs. Fine. Oh, I still had till the start of the next turn, but apparently not. Looking good. Um, Alright, the correct Gar is getting closer. One more of those and we'll be able to upgrade it, which is excellent. Let's go into the Come. hunting grounds. Serene, if you feel like it, these may be meat illusions, but they hit. The you know what? Kill. Let's get us a Do bunch of gold. I want a challenge. Oh. This enemy cycles between the two forms living in the ethereal. Kill that comes back. Great. Let's get a blood fay out there. Let's get a blood worm out there. Alrighty. He's gonna chunk. Oh no. Okay, we got a golem. That's fine. Let's get some uncontrolled. Power. Let's ritual up the worm. It's looking good. Come on, go. Maintain the hits. You can do it. 
Let's so go back to C. Let's get another worm out. Let's get some armor on him. You know what? Let's pump it up. Let's do a ton of damage. And let's... Not gonna promote him. Nah, I think we're fine. Still good. Blood Abomination. Volatile magic. Love to see that. Okay. It's fine. It's gonna heal. Just all the damage is going everywhere. Just doom, 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 doom. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'm having a hard time following some of it, but let's go ahead and debate you to. Get rid of other things that aren't gonna barrier ourselves. I should have cast that blood golem. Um Yes. It's fine. Should be okay-ish. Let's get that blood golem back. Because that's some crazy damage. Let's activate you. And we're looking good. Some smack of damage. Uh, ritual. You know what? I need another. Are we gonna need another? See the last one? I'm probably gonna need another one. That is not close to what I wanted to do. But it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, everything's fine. We would like to cast our worm. So, really love to heal ourselves for a ton. So, you'd love to see. Let's get a ritual out there. And that'll work. Okay. Let's so attack at the end of the turn or at the beginning of the turn. Interactivated at the end of each turn. Okay, that's fine. They promoted at the beginning. Okay, get that nice level too. Got a nod foot, because, sure. Reduce enemies' armor by 50, sacrifice a minion to stun all enemies. Eh. Invoke a blood fae and a blood worm. Okay. I like that idea. Got a bunch of gold. Where's the boss of this area? Got the health, that's what we've already dealt with. Just kind of running in circles. That was a way down it's way down there. Can I get there from here? Uh it looks like it. Maybe. Back enemies down there. Can I? Like, how is this not a thing? Okay, here we go. Legendary encounter. Yeah, that's the boss. And we got a pack of enemies and a famished prisoner. Let's get him all 
all buffed up. Let's get a worm and a fey. And another blood worm. Looking good. Powering through. No idea what. Oh, it's because of the tainted card. Let's promote you. Ritual. A ritual. That's. The Fey. So we can. Oh, never mind. <laughs> like, so that we can eat our golem at the end of the turn, but apparently I forgot that our worm was doing a metric ton of damage. Oh, there we go. Heal for five at the end of every combat, I think. Going to change. <laughs> and we will just. Pump our weapon damage up. I don't know if that affects our summons or not, but if it doesn't doing more damage isn't gonna help either. Prisoner, but he still doesn't answer. He rattles his chains in a rip. Uh great. Gain five percent damage each turn. How is love bumping damage? Let's see what's down this way. I see a milestone for some bump ups you know what let's bump up the range of this first Boost the range looking good let's go steal your treasure because it's going to be our treasure he gets eaten by that guy summon a fey and a worm Let's ritual up the worm. And let's give ourselves a little barrier. Let's get some protection out there. Some volatile magic. Wow. <laughs> I mean, what are the odds, right? Let's get another goal. Passive redirect. Shit reduces armor. Let's bump up his health. It's a ritual. That's uh, ritual. should be fine. Everything's turning into little soul orbs for the soul harvester, but... Attacking the things that have no health. I mean, the stupid slug that. There we go. I think exactly what I wanted. Ritual. <laughs> Just bouncing damage everywhere. And yikes. See what we can get for blood prep. Yes. And I'm just gonna feel like another worm as well. Alright, let's just keep damaging stuff going. 
You see health going up and down and things attacking everywhere. Increases armor. Remove a minion and activate it. Sure. Now let's get another golem out there. And let's hop our barrier up a little higher. Just in case. We're already doing enough damage to ourselves, we don't need anything extra done. Looking good. Let's get ourselves some you found what was cash. You filled your pockets up. Big pile of weird shards. Unlock a new armor slot. Um? Question. Can I want the armor slot just so I can also uh, rack out the five damage return to everybody? That's great, and I believe we should. Um, you know what? We will finish off this boss when I see you all again in the next adventure. Bye for now.